Law enforcement is a very stressful occupation. Law enforcement officers see things and hear things that they wish that they never had to see and hear. The traumatic event that occurred consumed who I was, and it tormented me for many, many years. And then aside from the normal stress, there's added stress with all that's been going on, especially in some of our bigger cities. It just builds up, becomes extra rocks in your backpack you're carrying around that are just gonna weigh you down until you break. It might feel like the world is against you, but there's still so many people that are not against you. There's people for you. Our law enforcement marriage retreats are designed to encourage law enforcement officers and their spouses who have been through trauma. When you're coming down the runway, you begin to see uh, the whole town out on the runway welcoming the plane. By the time we got to our room, we're crying. Because just so much love and genuine love. It's a very remote area. Uh, but yet uh, a beautiful setting for a marriage retreat and all of the activities that we have planned for them. We don't see bears like this in Chicago. If you saw the schedule, you might think, oh, well, this is a bunch of fun. Well, what it really is, is just an avenue by which we can build a community so we can get to the core and talk about the trauma, talk about marriage. So a lot of the activities here are designed to help us be able to talk about those things. A lot of the reason why our marriages struggle comes down to communication. This retreat is a way to address some of those challenges and traumas that officers and their spouses experience. Some of them are coming to the Lord, allowing God to come into the picture and bring healing. Since John's shooting, I have been sleeping well, and I slept here. Like, I really slept. Getting baptized with my husband was like amazing, and I'm never gonna forget this. All the love that was shown, there's so much love. It blew my mind. Hands down, the best thing I think we could have ever done. Just seeing what the Lord has done through the retreat so far is priceless.